guys it's dagonette and i'm back and so is this character um i decided that i really kind of missed streaming my shaman Torin after he got uh turned into hamburger in world of warcraft uh, uh hardcore and so um i was kind of tooling around with what i wanted to do whether i wanted to uh resurrect him in hardcore and have another go at it or whether i wanted to create a different type of class and try it or whether i wanted to i i just didn't know what i wanted to do and i did a little soul searching and uh, you know how things go with gaming and stuff it's like you don't necessarily want to go and actually um uh do the um uh, game that you really are not fond of. And I found that I just didn't enjoy hardcore as much as I thought I did. I enjoyed the character, but I didn't enjoy uh, playing hardcore. So I think that um, after thinking through that, that whole uh, scenario, I decided, you know, I want to give it another shot with the shaman because I've not leveled a shaman in classic. And um, uh, I have a shaman... <laughs> I have a, a couple of elemental shamans, and I have uh, one resto shaman, actually, uh, that I used to heal with. But um, uh, I haven't leveled any of them in the uh, through classic uh, phase. I, I started them uh, well into, uh, I don't know, Cataclysm or something like that. And uh, uh, so that's why I don't I haven't done this before. But anyway, my Torn is back. Um, and... Uh, I had done a little bit of research and found that I really hadn't set it up very well. And uh, when I was doing hardcore, I probably screwed the pooch with regards to uh, where I put my talent points. I found out that I kind of, I was going to do elemental on this guy and I ended up putting points under astral knowledge, which I thought would like help out my mana generation because shaman in classic are notoriously um known for not having a whole lot of sh of uh of uh mana and they have to keep drinking all the time it's like hey mana break you know that kind of stuff in, in groups and stuff but for leveling i i wanted to try to do him elemental and i've already thrown three knowledge um three talent points into astral knowledge which if you look and do the research they don't recommend that even for enhancement uh if i was going enhancement i should have gone spe uh shield, shield specialization <laughs> so anyway um this guy's a mess he doesn't have enough gold to be able to retune him so he's just going to go ahead and fumble through um i know that uh i'm going to get another talent point probably at the end of this um uh this particular level and so my first talent point in elemental will be um, uh, convection, and I need to like boost that all the way up. Anyway, long story short, um, the other stuff that's going on with this particular character is he is a uh, leather worker, and uh, he does skinning. So those are his two main professions. He likes to fish, and uh, he's trying to get the uh, fish recipe so he can fish and cook at the same time because that's actually one of the most efficient ways to uh, boost both of those skills uh, while you're doing it. So anyway, he's uh, going to be tooling around, and he's still out in Mulgore area, and uh, I'd like to finish the quest that he got nailed on when he was out there um, in Hardcore, and then kind of move on from there, so we'll have to see how it goes. So I had been messing around with him a few minutes before the stream started, and I wanted to finish getting my uh, le uh, leather crafting pulled together here. I wanted to see if he had any new recipes, because I got him up to uh, up to 50 on the leather crafting. So train me, brother. And he has nothing new to learn. Bummer. Okay. That's journeyman. Anything under expert, I wonder. Can you train me, sir? Oh, I can train under journeyman. Cool, train me. Any recipes? No, no new recipes. I just got journeyman. So now, that's fine. How much? I've only got eight silver left. This guy's poor. <laughs> he is poor as yet. Okay. All right, let's go play some WoW. Uh, this guy's up on um, 
he's happy actually sitting up on uh, 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 the Torn headquarters, and so I'm going to get him off of the area and go find the elevator. He's got an elevator over here somewhere. He's not going to worry about dying anymore because he's already been through that, right? I don't think I can get to the elevator. I'm going to go to this one instead. Doesn't quite run fast enough. And he doesn't have wolf form. Yeah, that's okay. So I had seen when I was out here before. First of all, there were a bunch of kitties behind me, but they weren't bugging me. It was the fact that I ended up pulling all four of these guys by accident instead of just one at a time. So, um, yeah, that was not a good thing. And uh, so that's how I ended up dying, as I ended up pulling everybody over there. Need to get... This guy's going to go down first, though. So. All right, one down. See if I can get this guy going around the corner. Oh, you see how my mana is? I'm so low. If I took him out right now, I wouldn't have enough mana to f uh, finish the fight. And that's even with the mana expansion stuff. So, okay, this guy's next. All right. Oh, and he pulled two. See how that happened? That's how I ended up getting crushed. I ended up getting the... Uh, um, the other critter in the back there as well. I'm going out of mana here. Oh, I got this guy halfway down. I'll just beat him to death. All right, that worked out a little better than last time. But he's already out of mana, so drink, drink, drink. I think I need to clear this guy on the left. Get him out of the way. And I think that that other ogre needs to go as well because he's roaming around doing circles. And once I get rid of him, I should be able to go in and... Um, should be able to go in and clean clean out this uh, well because that's what I have to do. I think the casting time is long enough. This guy would make it all the way around and be there waiting for me on the other side. It's like, ah, no. If I wait long enough, I don't have to like go and uh... boost my mana. There we go. Okay, let's see if I can do it. Oh, don't get close to me. I'm in the right place. Yay, got the well. So that's the quest where I died. I was like, ah. All right, I got one more of these quests out here I need to get, and that's the Horn of Arachia. And I think that Arachia is pretty close to where I need where I am already, so, yeah. So I'm just going to, like, amble on over here. Okay. 
Yeah, that's a Kodo, but that's not the right one. Let's see. Let's make sure I'm still headed in the right direction. Yeah, okay. He's over here somewhere. One of my teammates that I play with on Sundays, he was like, oh, leather, money bags. That's what he calls all of the critters that he kills. It's just money. There's the one I need. Get up someplace where I'm not going to have all the other critters getting involved. be an alchemist first of all they make a hell of a lot more money am I gonna make it yes yay Get some ice cold milk. And off and running. I need to pick up the flight point. I never picked the flight point up. Oh, there's what is this quest? Great Father Winter is here. Oh, okay. I'll give some good XP if I do that. So where do I turn this in? I thought it would Oh, it is over here. Okay. Do I need to go upstairs or downstairs? Downstairs. Now I needed to go upstairs. But let's talk to Father Winter while I'm here. Is he here? Oh, he must be in the hut. Was he? Is he? He is not. The map lies. It is not there. 
fine. Here, can you, like, repair me? I need to be repaired anyway. How may I aid you? No, you don't repair. Fine. Do you repair? No. You don't repair. You do. Okay. Let's see, I need to sell that and that. I think the rest is all good. Okay, so I didn't get what I wanted here. I need to go back upstairs. That's not the upstairs I needed. This place still drives me nuts. I still can never figure out where am I supposed to go again? It's got to be the one over here. Uh, I need to go up. Maybe Santa's over here, cooking suppliers. Oh, can I do anything with cooking? I can get spiced wolf meat. Do I have any? Probably not. Oh, I've got some charred wolf meat. Here, I'll just make some over here. Yay, charred wolf meat. So now I'm 15. <laughs> yeah, I really do need to, like, step up my game on cooking here. All right. There's who I turned in the quest to. Oh, I got some new pans. Thank you. And those are also better than what I can make for myself. So let's uh, throw a uh, armor kit on there. Cool. Fishing supplies. Hi. You want to buy some pants? There we go. Goodbye. Goodbye. Farewell. All right, looks like the next place I need to go is... I don't know, should I try... I should probably try to find Father Winter, but... I could have sworn it was there, but I don't think so. Woolworth Copper Pinch. Yeah, I don't think he's actually there, either that or... He disappeared, who knows? I don't know if you can see him from somewhere else. Oh, there he is, down there. Okay, so... I need to go down two levels? I need to go down two levels. There's the uh, quest giver. Yay! Oh, do I have a deal for you? Right back. Speak with Grandf Great Father Winter. He is located near the Smoky Wood Pastures Vendor area in Ogremar. I haven't. I means I got to go to Ogremar. Oh, okay. Yeah. All right. Do you have anything else? Anywhere. Show me your seasonal wares. Yeah, I don't want to spend too much. Alright, so I need to take a flight point over to Ogremar to finish that quest. Yeah, okay. 
there's some fun stuff out of it. Might as well. I'm not doing it on any other, the other of my uh, tunes, so might as well try it on this one. Hi, can you take me to Ogremar, or are you going to make me, uh... Oh, boy. Well, you know what? It's time to run. Let's go. How many times will it take for me... How many times will I die trying to get to Ogremar? <laughs> Once I get into Duratan, it should be fine, but man... Might as well link all the points here. And I got uh, leather workers inside the tent here, too. Hi, guys. I think I've already got all the stuff I need from you. Because I can't do any additional leather working recipes, I don't think. No, expert. There we go. So I need to get rid of already known, just available. There is nothing available. Okay. That's why I wanted to find out. So where do we go? Oh, all the way up there. All right. Well, I got to go there anyway. Might as well just run. Now, if I wasn't progressing through if i was just progressing through normally what i would probably do is finish the quests in mulgore and then head out here to the barrens anyway so this is not going to be like a uh, run to strangle thorn vale <laughs> where i'm like level three trying to get to strangle thorn vale and get chomped by all the cats and stuff this will be a little easier i think because stuff out here is fairly low as well. Um, no, 18. Yeah, it's it's sufficiently high enough it'll eat my face. But I wonder if it's quiet because this server where I am is kind of the refugee location for all of the uh, characters that died in um, classic hardcore. So, it's the loser's uh, server. Who knows? Could be. Yeah, I'm a big loser. What can I say? All right. So, I got 105 experience. Woohoo. I'm going to talk to Surga. Uh, you want to hunt the barons. Your eyes are eager and young. No kidding. They're not squinted from tracking your prey across the land's dry plains. But worry not. We'll toughen your body and your mind. And we'll teach you that there is more to hunting than finding and killing your quarry. Prepare yourself. Your journey begins now. Okay. Uh, she wants me... Oh, come back. She wants me to collect seven plain strider beaks and return them... Uh, return them. Okay. And I get... Put down the plain strider and return to me with their beaks. All right. I'm not going to do that right now because they're all over the place. <laughs> and they're five levels higher than I am. But I also want to go turn in the other quests and get up to uh, Ogrimmar. Oh, was there... There's a fight point here someplace that I need to connect. Is he the fight? Oh, there it is. Yay. My flight point has been discovered. My Thunder Bluff reputation has increased by 10. Sometimes I wonder if I should um, make Ogromar my main location yet. Probably want to not do that yet, huh? 
because I'm still doing stuff here in the Barrens. I can make uh, Crossroads my my home. Now I should be okay. I can kill model boar and get some uh, rep while I'm running around here. That'd be a good thing to do, I guess. Come back here, piggy. Chunk of boar meat. I think I need that for cooking, don't I? Yes! I can do roasted boar meat. So I might as well kill these guys while I'm running around. No meat? I have yet to meet a pig I didn't like, but that was one. Dude, my mana is out. Here, piggy, I'll just like level my uh, mace on you. I didn't get any mace. Fine. Skinning increase, but not my mace. it over the head just for good measure. I don't think the scorpid uh, give you any meat. You just get uh, like a tail or something like that from them. I'm trying to remember if there's a flight point here that I can pick up. I think there's, a, there's an inn. I know that, but I don't know whether there's a flight point. There's a Christmas tree. Can I sell some junk? Maybe not. What is this? Unique held in offhand. No price. Oh, that's a quest. I don't want to give that away. Uh, ba -da -ba -da. Yeah, see, I need to level my fishing, too, because it's like none of this stuff is going to be helping me out. It's all too low. I need to start paying attention to my my professions. All right, there was no... Uh, Flight point there, so I need to just run. I guess it kind of goes to the same discussion about whether people like, um, whether people like the uh, um, horde side of the story, or whether they like alliance side. So, my first characters were alliance. And um, we ended up having a couple of folks in our Alliance Guild who uh, were wanting to see the other side. They wanted to see the other storyline. And, uh, you know, there's always two sides to every story, right? Everyone knows that. So um, we ended up uh, creating a guild on the... Uh, horde side as well and so we had it helped out because we were like able to do we did trading and stuff like that on the um uh you know through the auction house and <laughs> being able to trade back and forth and move gold around and stuff like that and but um we have in that particular guild um we ended up having uh 
Christmas parties where there were people that would come online as their um, their horde characters, and then we would come online as the alliance characters, and we would all meet up uh, out in um, oh I forget which area, but it was like it was a neutral zone for both of us, and we were able to like go and party and have fun doing it. We were all on uh, a Ventrilo at the time and just having a good time. So that was that was back in the when things were really cool with World of Warcraft and you had like 15 million people playing at the time and stuff like that. And bring five gingerbread cookies and ice cold milk. And I got to go get the recipe for the cookies, I think. And let's see, I've got, what? What is this supposed to be? Oh, the reason for, well, no, that's the guy I just did it. I don't want to talk to Furman, do I? Yeah, the reason for the season. Oh, I guess what I do. You here? Speak the Sagrone Crest Rider in the Valley of Wisdom about the Feast of the Winter Vale. Okay. The Might as well do that while I'm here, right? And uh, I need to figure out where that is. Oh, up up around and oh yeah this place drives me insane too okay oh someone beating on a drum or something oh yeah i don't think i've ever been here on the hour and now you can't hear it Greetings, traveler. Walk with me, reason for the season the feast of winter vale you say alas in times past it held a more substantial meaning to us torrin nowadays it seems as though others have turned the legend of this season of renewal into something that helps to sell candies and presents it's no surprise that Fermund is bitter about that sort of change he and other torrin like him cling to our past like a banner of war while i think a little celebration is always good it is important to remember the origins of the feast I agree. That actually is dead on. Yeah. Here, if you are interested in learning more about the Feast of Winter Vale, read this book. While I think our recognition of the legend is the appropriate one, I am enough of a student of legends to appreciate the collection of all information into a single source. When you're done, take the book to Karn Bloodhoof and uh, uh, Thunderbluff. Well, now I'll be able to fly there. I know for a fact that he'd be interested in hearing that others have taken an interest in the lore of our people. Feel free to read the book, The Feast of Winter Vale, to learn more about the holiday. When you are finished with the book, deliver it to Karen Bloodhoof in Thunderbluff. I will do that. And while I'm here, is there anything I can crane on, please? I wish I could unlearn my talents. Yes, I know. I do not have a gold. I do not have talents to unlearn. Well, I do have talents to unlearn, but I cannot learn them now. Okay, Flame Shock. I'm going to burn all my money getting trained. No, I'm not, because I can't train on this. Good Lord. Uh Let's see. Returns the spirit of the body, restoring a dead life. I don't have enough to get that. Don't have enough. Eh, forget it. Okay. I am in dire straits here, folks. I cannot train for crap. All right. I think I'm a little too early to be out in this area, but I've got to go back anyway. So where is the flight point? Oh, the flight point's outside, huh? No, it's up there. There it is. All right. So I need to go back and around there's the flight point excuse me mr. Ogar I need a ride can you take me back to Thunder Bluff please thank you all right and with that I am going to take a quick break and I will be back shortly Hang in there, guys.
All right, I'm back. And he just landed, believe it or not. So that entire time he was flying. Which I knew it was a long flight, so I was fine taking the amount of time I did to go get coffee. My coffee is now warm. Hi, Chieftain. How you doing? Greetings, young one, and welcome to Thunder Bluff. You'll find safe refuge from the burdens of the world here. I think he already told me this. All denizens of the Horde are welcome here. The spirits of the present and the past come alive here in this sacred place. My friend, honor them, and in doing so, honor yourself. Tell me about the feast. I bid you welcome to Mulgore and our humble community of the Thunder Bluff, friend. I always take an interest in those who choose to take an interest in the kingdom, its people, and its lore. Is this why you are standing before me? Yes. The legends and lore surrounding the Winter Vale are ones that have faded from the forefront of public through uh, over the years, though, over the years. Yes, I know that the goblins are helping to revive the season for their own ends. Ah, yeah. Time is money, friend. Um, the fact that our people reflect upon it at least in some form uh, does good to keep such lore alive. Your desire to go beyond the material and learn about our past is an admirable trait, young shaman. I salute your wisdom. Cool. So I got 650 out of that. Um, thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you very much. Where do I need to go? Um, I don't have, I got some quests all around here, but you know what? I'm kind of tired of questing in this area. So I think I'm going to get out of this area and go, uh, I'm going to go find the elevator. Where's the elevator? Did they even show the elevator on the maps? No. I know it's... Well, i got to go over there somewhere. We'll just go there. Fill in the map. Run around. There's the elevator. I can see the totem hanging out in the middle of everything. Weapons Master. I don't have enough coin to do anything here. I've got five. Five silver. That's it. So my character that I have in World of Warcraft... Um, hardcore that I run with on Sundays with my group, the pixel racer team. They are, um, my character there is a night elf and, uh, she is a night elf druid. And I found that leveling a druid as, um, it's, it's not as painful as the shaman. I don't think, of course, I'm also leveling as a group. So that's kind of tough to make a call. I don't know what it would be like leveling solo uh, like this guy. But um, I will say that um, doing the leveling and leveling my crafting skills there, and I chose herbalism and alchemy. I've already got that, that character's level, I want to say 16. And I've already got that character um to gold just from doing some crafting and alchemy and selling it on the auction house so i'm starting to think that may be what i want to do with this character because i can also make stuff like the healing potions and stuff like that and it might be a better a better solution than what i've chosen leather crafting and and uh, uh leather working 
because I find that in in the quests that I'm doing, I'm out leveling the gear uh, that I can make a lot faster than I can actually get any benefit from it. So, of course, that also may be a um, factor of me leveling out leveling the area. I don't know. It's a weird combination at lower levels trying to figure out how to make some money. Oh, we'll give you a better staff. No, we'll give you a staff. It's not better than what you're currently using. I can't use Axe. All right, well, choose a reward, fine. May the eternal sun Sell that. Maybe I get some, get up enough gold to do some training. Still didn't get enough, uh, enough uh, uh, XP to hit, hit 13. Oh, well. There's the innkeeper. Excuse me, Mr. Innkeeper. Uh, I want to browse your goods. Can I sell this staff? Because it's not any good. Thank you. Call a fire. Torch, torch of the dominant. Where do I? Oh, I got to turn those in. I think I'm done with this stuff. Be careful. All right. I gotta go find some fire because I want to cook up some boar meat. Oh, was that? Is the book in my inventory anymore? It is not. I had to turn it in. Now, see, they should have allowed you to keep the book because the only opportunity to read it would have been when you're traveling from Ogremar to uh, Thunderbluff in order to turn in the quest. So I guess, you know, is it a five minute read? Because <laughs> it takes, well, 10 minute read because it takes longer than 10 minutes to uh, to run? I don't know. Oh, that's a bummer. I kind of wanted to read it too. See what they had to say. Oh, well. C'est la vie. Make some more meat. Wolf meat and boar meat all look like chicken legs. So I'm up to level 19 for cooking. Woohoo. Still can't do anything with it. Uh, okay. Where am I headed? Uh, is it time to go to, oh, you know, I really could use a couple more levels before I take on, uh, the Barons. Where do I go for this? Bring the torch of the Dhamma to, oh, Dur Durtar. I was just there. Oh, got to go. Okay. I got to go do that. Ah, bummer. So also cooking. Where's the cooking trainers here? Because I might be able to find the uh, gingerbread cookie recipe. Hopefully. Maybe. Please. That's a stable master. There we go. No, I don't want to. I don't want a story. Yeah, they don't have the sentries that tell you what to do here.
Okay, so gotta remember what I was gonna do here. Why did you come here? Um, I need to see if there's a, the cooking folks have. It's a bag vendor. Well, is there anything that I can sell here? There's a discolored fang. Okay, well, and what's this? Tiger eye. I can't do anything with that. Stringy wolf meat I need. Weapons merchant. Oh, let's see. Where's that's bread vendor. All right. Tell me where the cooking person is, because I already know that I've seen it, but I need cooking. Uh, Thunder Bluff. I can smell what she's cooking from here. Good. So she's... Upstairs or downstairs? I think she's upstairs. Oh, she was downstairs. Okay. Or... Was she up another level? No, she wasn't up another level because the next level up is the flight master, right? No, no, maybe she is. There, there she is. See, I told you I can never remember when any, where any of this stuff is. There's a cooking supplier. There she is. Hi. Can you train me? No. You have no... You know... <sighs> Man, you don't have the cooking cookie recipes? That sucks. Oh, but this guy's got the uh Oh yeah, you gotta be up to That's right. I ran into the same thing with my other character. First off, I don't have enough to buy any well, I could buy long jaw mud snapper. And I've got a few of those. I got some of those in the bank. But my cooking skill has to be up to 50, and it's only what right now? 12? 19. All right, well. I'm going to cook up some charred meat. That puts me at 20, and I still don't have... Yeah, still nothing. Nada. Okay, so the other thing I had, I was wanting to see that, and then I also want to take flight path. So I want to jump on. Uh, that guy made it to the lower level. <laughs> Good thing it's not hardcore. What brings you here? I need a ride, please. Um, crossroads. Is it closer to the crossroads? Might be closer to the crossroads, huh? Turn in that uh, shaman quest. And I'm pretty sure they don't have Yeah, see, they don't have... I think they have a cooking trainer here. There's a baker. Does the baker have a recipe? No, she does not. Okay. Just thought I'd check. Uh, you know what? I'm going to be spending a lot of time here. Yes. All right, I'm now in the crossroads. Now, where is this crest? It's up on a hill someplace. Do I see a magnifying glass? I don't want to zoom out. I want to zoom in. Oh, there it is over there. I thought it was... 
Oh, poo. Well, okay. There's no flight path over there anyway. I gotta run, so... Ugh. Welcome to the Torn Running Show. <laughs> run, Forest, run. Oh, I gotta remember where do you climb the mountain? That's the thing. I think it's on this side. I don't think you have to mess with any of the uh, the guys on that side, though. Is that the path? It looks like a path. It's a path. It isn't necessarily the path, but we shall see. We can get past the Venom Tail Scorpid. We shall f Oh, yeah, it might be. Oh, no, of course he's not going to leave me alone. Fine. Oh, and he zapped me, too. So, oh, luckily it's only 39 seconds. If it was going to be one of those ones where it's like, yeah, you are you got five minutes, it's like, oh, that may have been the end of the stream right there. Hang out for five minutes while my health comes back up, because I think you have a battle to do up here. Is this the right way? Yes, this is. That was a heck of a path. Especially there. <laughs> Wait, where'd the path go? It's underneath the trees. Oh, good lord. There. Telf Julum. Hello. Greetings, Daganatoni. You found yourself at the Shrine of the Dormant Flame. Only these, those knowledgeable enough in the shamanistic arts will ever learn the secrets of this place and power it, uh, the power it holds. I'm sorry you made the trip all this way, only to be turned back now. The journey up here is far from safe after all, but I am the keeper of the shrine, and I cannot allow just anyone to wander around up here. Oh, come on. Ah, oh, my mistake. Dagonet Tony, I apologize. I did not realize you possess the torch. I am pleased to make your acquaintance. Many adventurers find their way here while looking for lost treasure or the promise of the mystical creatures to slay, only to be turned away from a seemingly empty shrine. But you, we know the truth, do we not, Dagatoni? This shrine holds a greater secret from the mundane members of the Horde. To us, it is sacred. But you did not come here for a history lesson, did you? Well, maybe I did. You came for the Eternal Flame and the Fire Totem. Uh, the first step is to create Sapta and bind you to the flame. Um, a Sapta. I can create the Fire Sapta for you if you bring me two items. The first is Fire Tar, a simple item usually carried by Razor Main spellcasters in the Eastern Barrens. The second item will be more dangerous, a reagent pouch from one of the cultists of the Burning Blade. You can find them in a, in a cave about, above the ravines northeast of Razor Hill. Oh, yeah, this is... Okay, this is going to take me a couple levels to do, so I am not going to do that. Don't have enough time to do that today, folks. Because guaranteed I will die several times making an attempt at this level. So instead, what I might do is um, go back to Ogramar and see if I can't find the uh, cookie recipes. And then figure out what I want to do with my, uh, let's see if I take, 
just think about this for a second, folks. Um, I've got this at the crossroads. So I'm going to go back to the crossroads and then take the flight path from crossroads to Ogramar. And that'll be a little bit more efficient. Then maybe I'll have enough time to be able to do the other stuff, right? Beverage merchants. Do I need milk? No, I've got plenty of milk. Just a reminder for folks, um, the Pixel Erasure team is going to be taking the next two Sundays off because it is Christmas Eve and then New Year's Eve. And uh, people want to be with their families and have fun and stuff like that. So uh, we're not going to be streaming on the next two Sunday nights. Um, I will be streaming next week during the week. And... Uh, so, you know, watch for me on Tuesday, Wednesdays, and Thursdays. Uh, Peep and I will... Oh, Peep and I will not be streaming next Wednesday. Um, she's going to be out of town. And uh, so that's a thing. <laughs> I will see what I want to do on Wednesday. I may take advantage of having uh, no stream that day, or I may end up uh, uh, doing something fun. Unexpected. We'll have to see. I may just do a chatting and gaming thing for next Wednesday. This guy wants to go to the auction house first. He wants to see if he can find um, Vermund. Thank you so much for giving me the info. Uh, he wants to... Oh! Has this guy got the recipes? Nope. Are we looked at him i think yeah so yeah no he doesn't have the recipes bummer can i sell anything no my feather is not needed that i need yeah i think we're good with this stuff all right back. Let me see. Is this auction? This is the bank. Do I have anything in the bank? I don't think I have anything in the bank. Let's find out. I don't think I've been to a bank yet. What are you looking for? No, I haven't. Okay. So, I haven't been to the bank. I've got all this food. I can't do anything with any of this stuff yet. I. Okay. So, I've got nothing in the bank. Show, can you tell me where the cooking person... Oh, well, let's see. We were going to go to the auction house. Don't get distracted. Okay. So, um, troll blood. No one's selling troll blood here. Is there any trolls? Anything? Trolls blood potion. Wow. Oh, this is mighty troll blood potion level 26. Yeah, no, there's, um, strong. Is that the one I, I was making? Regenerate six health every five seconds for that might be the one I was making and it actually sells a whole lot better here Wow, oh weak blood that's still better Yeah, see this Okay, weak blood potion still sells better. Okay, so let's see about the leather uh, Boss leather pants no no one's selling just bulk leather, I guess. Light leather? How about light leather? Oh, people are selling it for 29. Hmm. Nah. Okay, that convinces me. I need to get rid of the other and start picking so 
tell me, not Great Father Winter, but tell me, Mr. Grunt, where can I find the trainer for profession trainer? I would like to do alchemy. Look uh, in the middle of the drag, west of the huge tree. <laughs> There's a huge tree? Um, where's the tree? Oh, way over there. Okay. Well, here we go. The rest of the stream is going to be me running around trying to figure out how to get rid of my leather working and leather crafting. So there's a huge tree someplace. Traveling gear, cloth goods, is that the big tree that they're talking about? Must be, huh? That's the big tree they were talking about. Ooh. Blood and thunder. Train me. All right. I need to see. I need to figure out how to get rid of my other professions first. Hopefully they don't charge you, because if they charge me, I'm stuck. Uh, see. Uh, skills. Unlearn this profession. And then skinning. Unlearn this profession. Cool. Okay, now I can learn. Great, now I know alchemy. And I need to get a crap ton of empty vials. There we go. All right, now I need to find where the herbalism trainer is. Hello. Profession trainer. Uh, I know there's herbalism somewhere. There it is. And, oh, like right here. Or she below. She's on the other side of this area. Is she? Nope. Nope. This is her. This is enchanting. I don't want enchanting. Well, crapola. Tell me where herbalism is. Thank you. Is it upstairs? It must be upstairs. No. Oh, still upstairs? Yep, the Arboretum. How are you? Spirit be with you, man. I don't... don't be shy. You don't need... Well, I don't need... And I don't have enough money to get the uh, herb pouch, because that would fill up my last pouch here. So I need to... Stay away from the voodoo. Yes, thank you for the advice. Okay. I guess I'll need to go do some flower picking. So let's get rid of that. 
and uh, open up my skills. Nope, nope, need to open up that. And I don't care where I drop it. So we kept kept those, but we need, uh, blah, 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 blah. Let's see. I need picking and I need alchemy. So I'm going to put alchemy there. I'm going to move this stuff down. Well, actually, yeah, I still need fine herbs. And now it's up there. What did I learn here? I learned something. Lightning bolt two. Did I? Yeah, I've got that already. Flame shock. Oh, that's what I forgot to put in there. Might as well use it. Am I using two for? Yes, I am. Okay. And uh, enhancement. Uh, do I have rock biter two? Yes, I do. And stone skin. And Lightning Shield. Cool. And Resto. Healing Wave 2. Yes, that's all done. I have found that. Now I need to find a cooking trainer. Professions. Cooking. Uh, the drag from the valley... Uh, Okay, so where is she in the drag? Back the other way. So I need to go down anyway. This way would probably be a better way than jumping to my death. And then back to the entrance of the drag. Both goods. Nope, not there. That's a bag vendor. Oh, she's upstairs, huh? Yeah, the fire pit. Meanwhile, the barbecue joint. Cooking supplier. Do you have the recipe? Oh, you got those two. How about... Nothing. Well, terrific. Okay, so you guys don't sell those. I guess I'm going to have to research who sells the gingerbread uh, recipe. Because I haven't a clue. I'm clueless. Which you guys knew already anyway, right? So he, this guy is, has a choice. He can either go back to, uh, I think he's going to get out of here and go find, because I can do like herbalism and, and go pick herbs and stuff. I'm high enough level. I should be able to do that here in Duratan. I just have to go all the way to the south end of everything. I wonder if this one has it. Need vendor. No, she doesn't. What's the armory? Let's go hang out in the Inn? Is this the inn? That's the gamekeeper. Everyone's hanging out in here, so I might as well hang out in here. And so if uh, you, I don't see you before Tuesday, have a good day. Have a good afternoon. Definitely have a good night. Love you all. Be sure to hit like if you uh, liked what I'm doing. And follow me on the stream. And I'll see you later. Bye now.